small intestinal bacterial overgrowth is a result primarily of low stomach acid. When we have low stomach acid, then we don't have the disinfectant capacity from swallowing millions of bacteria every time we swallow, they get past our gut, hydrochloric acid, and into our small intestine where they can thrive and cause problems. One study showed an association between the amount of small intestinal bacterial overgrowth and rheumatoid arthritis, meaning the worse the SIBO, the more RA symptoms. So your small intestine can get leaky gut as well. It's not just in the bowel. So we need to have high levels of hydrochloric acid in the stomach, this means if you're taking proton pump inhibitors like omoprazole, we are got to unravel all this stuff. And this is what the doctor helps with. Because if you're suppressing stomach acid, causing more small intestinal bacterial overgrowth, this is at the expense of your intestinal health and it causes more dysbiosis further down the track in your bowel. SIBO is a problem. Increased stomach acid is the answer. Stress really, really depletes stomach acid. So we loop back to those three things again. We've got to really become in a really happy place, enjoying life, seeing progress steadily, become physically fit and get our diet right.